the world of cryptocurrency, things move fast. And nowhere is that more true than at Blockonomics. Their YouTube channel has seen it all. Everything from viral videos to videos with no views. It all started with a simple how-to video on creating a Bitcoin invoice. Well, there was an earlier video, but I couldn't get the staff to open up about that one. The newly minted manager of media and communications, aka the intern, had taken his first step to grow the fledgling channel. Create easy single use uh, in invoices, and the second way, using Bitcoin's Wallet Watcher feature. Yeah, it was just me in my dorm room in college. Why I felt the need to include an intro on a short, regular product demo video, I'll never know. I had the strangest ideas back then. But the channel was growing. It had everything from informative tutorials to hilarious skits. Interviews with their customers ranging from a fellow in Finland to a lady in South Africa. I decided to put my acting skills together, so I came up with one of the greatest videos ever. Without a doubt, best video Blockonomics ever made. It was Emmy winning material. Being an e-commerce entrepreneur is tough. Everything from operations to logistics to personnel. Emmy winning material, all right. And then, Blockonomics finally broke through with its first truly viral video. All right, so first up, we're going to take a look at what kind of fee should you be using to send Bitcoin? It was the dark times. Bitcoin transaction fees were up, the blockchain was clogged, so we decided to run with it. The video collected tens of thousands of views in just a few days. It was a success. And the Blockonomics community grew as well, with many people leaving helpful comments for other subscribers. But it wasn't all fun and games. It was around this time that we hit a thousand subscribers. But no matter how hard I tried, I just couldn't get the success of the transaction fee video again. It was really hard. I was drained. It was like running into a brick wall. The channel needed new blood. It needed a savior. That's when Isadora came. She kept the steam going. All I did was make cool shorts. I put my mind to it and made it work. We went from zero to a thousand in five years. We went from one to two thousand in two years. So here's to you, Blockonomics. Keep on making us laugh, cry, and most importantly, learn. Because in the world of cryptocurrency, there's always more to discover. <laughs>